70-year-old James Bingham was a professional classical singer for 30 years when his voice started to fail him. I couldn't control my voice and it was interfering with my profession and my money making. Keep them up. In 2012, he was diagnosed with progressive multiple sclerosis and eventually couldn't sing anymore. He decided he wanted to help others by taking part in a new study at Columbia University Medical Center, testing an experimental drug called Ibutilast. It's actually part of my healing to be able to extend myself away from myself and feel like I am doing something for other people. Dr. Claire Riley authored the study, which found the drug slowed brain atrophy or shrinkage by almost 50%. This is a very exciting result. Dr. Riley says more research is needed to see if the drug actually improves MS symptoms and slows the disease. Walking or thinking, controlling your bladder, controlling your coordination. So all the wonderful things that your brain and spinal cord does can be affected. The study was funded by the National Institutes of Health. It involved 255 MS patients from 28 centers around the country. Bingham doesn't know yet if he received the drug or a placebo, but he's grateful the research is being done. I hope that that step brings us closer to a cure for muscle sclerosis. A disease he says needs more treatment options. Wendy Gillette, CBS News, New York.